Thank you. Um, in the, past, the points of order are withdrawn. In the past several years, incidents of domestic terrorism struck communities around our country. HBCUs were recently terrorized by a wave of bomb threats. Asian Americans were the victims of unconscionable violence, and the sanctity of our houses of worship was pierced by hostage taking and other acts aimed at harming and terrorizing minorities. If these heinous acts are left unanswered, they'll continue. Doing nothing is not an option. This bipartisan legislation provides the resources and tools that law enforcement and communities need to combat uh, these threats. While some Republicans continue to obstruct, I'm sorry, to construct straw men to distract from their record on domestic terrorism, we're, we're moving forward with bipartisan legislation that will make our community safer for everyone. And I oppose the amendment because it creates a carve out to the anti-terrorism uh, legislation, uh, essentially for school board officials, it would, it would prevent the beneficial effects of this bill from helping school board uh, and, and other education officials. So on that basis, I oppose the amendment, and I urge all my colleagues to oppose the amendment.